Welcome back, back again. Welcome back, back again. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Yeah, boom, <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Simpson Sasha Phone 4 here, and I have a new video for you guys. So, hopefully, and before I get started, hopefully you guys don't hear my fan because it's like really hot in here. Like, I'm like sweating, and then these lights makes it like 10 times hotter. But, um, yeah, anyways, today I'm going to be doing a New Year's goals and resolutions video, um, and kind of give you guys a little bit of tips, like a couple pointers on how to maybe achieve those goals and things that I'm going to do so basically we're both doing it together and then I'm going to share some of my goals with you guys so if you see me looking down it's just because I have like some notes on my notebook right here my handy dandy notebook so yeah so um before we get started I want to just recap of last year last year I believe was my kind of hardest year mentally and like not a lot of people know that a couple people I can count them on my fingers I had a really um, like hard year last year mentally and a lot of stuff went um, on in my life that is just a lot and I'm sure a lot of people go through but yeah it was a really it was it wasn't like it wasn't a horrible year but it was a really kind of rough year and um, a learning experience too but um, that being said I am grateful for all the lessons that I've gone through you know it's something to build you up every everything that you go through is going to be a part of your story and make you a better person so i don't look at it as like oh it sucked and it was a horrible thing i just look at it as a learning experience and honestly that's how we should all look at things so yeah i'm gonna get started so what i did with my goals is i broke them down into categories and i'm gonna go ahead and let you know what categories i broke them down into the first category I broke it down to was self goals like goals about you that you want to change or your body or things like that things about the, you basically and then um, the second thing is my YouTube goals so like let's say you do surfing so you would put you know your surfing goals that you would want down in that category this probably is like self-explanatory self-explanatory and then the other one is work goals like my job because sadly youtube is not my full-time job even though i hope someday maybe it will be so yeah work goals and then the other thing is just like miscellaneous like random goals not random but like the you know other goals so first i will read you guys some of my goals for myself one is to get closer to god i want to read the bible more get more familiar with his word um i already go to church but you know i need to get that one-on-one -on -one relationship so yeah that's one of my goals another goal is to get in better shape not i mean yes i do want to lose weight but like i just want to feel better like you know i always feel tired a lot and like bleh, like Blech, that's how I can explain it but yeah I don't want to feel like that anymore I want to eat better even though I'm not doing a really good job right now I really want to eat better um I also want to in program in my mind that everyone has their own path or story to live and everybody's story is not going to be the same um sometimes I think that I have to be like perfect or things have to be a certain way in my head and I need to just let go and live life and not think like oh everything has to be perfect because no one's perfect and I mean I know I'm not perfect but I try to be so yeah I also want to love more forgive and take time out for myself like you know like a pamper night <laughs> keep plugging if you did not see my pamper night it'll be down in the down bar you should guys should go check it out but yeah you should also you should always take time to be with yourself and relax and take care of yourself and things like that so that's um, another one and then for my YouTube goals is I want to have a thousand subscribers by May and I think it's possible guys so if you want to help me get to that goal you should hit the thumbs up button right oh you should hit the subscribe button right now and the thumbs up button hey what the heck but you should hit the subscribe button right now and help me reach my goal of a thousand by May so you can help you can help this goal out right now so pause the video it's okay I'll wait hit subscribe and then you know continue and the next one is be more creative with my videos and become better 
become better at filming and also editing. And for my work goals, I need to do this 40 hour test. So it's a 40 hour test. I work in a daycare. If you know, you have to take a 40 hour or 45 hour test. So I need to do that. Um, I want to learn how to make lesson plans because yes, I want to be a teacher and also I want to get a raise. I mean, but who doesn't want that? So yeah. And then my other goals, like miscellaneous goals is one, go to playlist live and hopefully by the time you guys see this, I have, I would have already bought my ticket. So fingers crossed. Um, travel to Mexico slash or Dubai and slash or Dubai go to VidCon and go to BeautyCon I want to go to a lot of more um, YouTube events so hopefully that happens so yeah those are all my goals for this year or month or week or you know coming up so yeah so like I said you break your goals into categories self goals job goals your like hobby kind of goals and you know your miscellaneous goals and I think that would help like you see it better and clearly so yeah and then here are some tips for achieving those goals yay tips let's get into tips first tip is set goal times like a time limit like I want to lose so and so weight by February and you know because once you put a like time on it you kind of more like Basically, once you put a deadline on something, you're more like willing to like work harder because you have a deadline instead of like by, you know, I just want to lose weight or I just want to eat healthier or I just want to do this, you know, set a deadline and that should help you stick to reaching that goal. The next tip is make your goals visible. It's really um, a big help, helpful thing if you make it visible like visual like if you get sticky notes and write down your goals and stick it on your like front door like maybe make it out of a heart of sticky notes and um put your goals on them and then like every time you come to your room you'll see the goals and you will always be reminded of the goals you want to reach or you can get like a big calendar or like a a visual board like the bulletin boards um i'm gonna get one of those like a small one and put it up um either above my calendar if you guys see i have a huge calendar back here which is like a lifesaver but yeah, I'm either going to put it above it or under it. But yeah, a vision board is really helpful. But like seeing it is really, really helpful. The next thing is to tell a friend or like a loved one. Um, someone that can hold you accountable for it. Like um, if you tell your best friend, hey, I want to lose 30 pounds by uh, February. Can you just kind of like, you know, check on me or say, hey, did you go work out today? Kind of saying like a good friend or loved one that's going to be very motivating and inspiring to keep you inspired to work out and then the last tip i have is to stay positive and inspired and you can stay positive by like following people on um instagram that are like fitness people or however whatever you're like trying to whatever your goal is try to follow things that pertain to that goal is what i'm trying to say like um if it's fitness because fitness is kind of like the big one that everybody's trying to do if you want to do fitness you should like follow people on instagram that do fitness things and that inspire you or have the body type that you want um, or on Pinterest there's a lot of like things that you can do if you want to be more creative you know Pinterest has like some ideas that can help you become more creative or get better at editing you can go on YouTube and follow some big youtubers that are really great at editing so yeah you know just a little little things like that can help and help you achieve your goals and I but yeah also the winner of my giveaway will be in the down bar so go ahead and check out the winner and if you do not respond in two days i'm gonna email you tomorrow night if you don't respond in two days then i'll pick another winner um so yeah it's a 25 dollars gift card to either amazon sephora or i think ulta i said ulta so you guys so you can the winner can you know check it out but your name your name will be in the down bar so anyways thank you guys so so much for watching thank you for so much love on my last three videos if you haven't seen them you can check out my last video down below um actually i'll list them all down below so you guys can go check it out and thank you guys so much we're so close to 800 subscribers so if you're new to my channel and you like the video or you want to see more of my videos check them out down below or like this video and subscribe thank you guys so so much and i'll see you guys on my next video bye